How's it going, everyone? Let me switch this like that. So, this is a brand new Motorola One Ace 5G from Metro. Costs right now between $20 and $29 if you sign up and you're a new user. And you're thinking, okay, so this sounds like a bad deal. I mean, because I switched from Mint to Motorola basically so I could switch back to Mint and get a new customer deal again. And by doing that, I got this phone also. And I'm coming from a Motorola Z2 Force 2017 Verizon edition, four gigabytes of RAM, Snapdragon 835, basically one of the best phones of 2017, but it is now, as you know, 2021. This new Motorola here has a Snapdragon 750G and 6 gigabytes of RAM. Has more gigabytes of RAM. Has a HD screen, but the Z2 Force screen is slightly better. I think the Z2 Force was at OLED. But, as you can see here, it is locked to 40 FPS. The 2017 Z2 Force straight out of the box would do HD and extreme 60 frames per second. And if you're looking here, you'll see this doesn't even do 40 frames per second in HD. There's really absolutely no excuse for that. This phone has plenty of power to do it. And... People need to start asking questions. Is this Motorola and the phone companies doing this? Or is this Tencent throttling your phones because they have agreements with other phones? Like, for instance, OnePlus, who had an exclusive deal to be the only 90 frames per second phone on PUBG for a long time. Now... If I was to turn on GFX tool, this instantly would allow me to go and easily do 60 frames per second extreme rate. But PUBG will ban you for doing that. Some people say that's not true. It won't happen. Some people have said, absolutely, I got banned for using GFX tools to just change the frames per second. So, the game is capable of it. The phone is capable of it. Why is it that these phones in 2021 are coming locked to 40 frames per second? And I think we all know it's probably money. It's either money that the phone companies are not paying $0.10 or money $0.10 is getting from other phone companies to make sure certain phones are not allowed to do this. Now, I have heard from someone, I have not contacted them myself, or received it. I've contacted them, I haven't received a <clears throat> response, but someone else did. And Motorola claims that they are not the ones that are doing this, that it is all Tencent. So, Tencent, get your shit together. Or hopefully Crafton and New State don't do this garbage. Because this is 2021, there's no excuse for that. And I'm not going to go and do any gameplay here. But you could easily see that this does not has massive lag when you go in to try and do anything like uh, TDM or anything like that. So hopefully y'all see this and maybe Motorola sees it or Tencent sees it or someone and they get on this crap because this is, this is just garbage. So thanks for checking it out. Talk to you later.